Howdy folks, welcome back to the Rathcoe Gaming Channel. I'm your host, Robert Robbie Rath. And we're back in Miss Survival. That's my primary save game. I managed to run past the two Seekers and gain access to the hotel. Um, I'm revisiting the Old West Town. Because I, as you guys know, I hit the loot refresh button. So I'm just going back and collecting pretty much anything I can find and anything I have room to carry. Because I am running short of space rather quickly. <coughs> and I figured I would show you guys what can be found within these walls. This is the hotel of the Old West Town. Okay, so a lot of paper and a lot of matches on the first floor, as well as some food and cans of pop. On the second floor, there are a number of different rooms. Um, this room, I know that you need a key for, or you can unlock it using a crowbar or a lockpick, which I don't think I have a crowbar with me. No, I don't. I also don't have a lockpick, so we're not going to be doing that just yet. We can head in here. There's pencil and more paper. More paper over here. A bottle. Two, two bottles. Drawers are empty, including those drawers. I believe in this bathroom, yes, there is, well, there used to be an AK rifle. But maybe because I got so many of them, they stopped spawning or something. Because I have like three of them. Uh, syringe, I don't need, obviously. Okay, and I don't even know if there's a purpose for the syringes in this game as of yet. That room's empty. This leads out to the balcony. Which we're not going to spend too long outside because for all I know those bastards can freaking climb. <laughs> okay, we got some salt. Uh, fishing line, which I don't need so I'm not going to bother swapping anything out to pick that up. Empty. 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 And empty. Okie dokie. The wallet with the code to this door is in the church, uh, but we're going to handle that in another time because we have to take out both the Seekers. So once I get the high quality metal scraps that I need to mount a machine gun onto my vehicle, then we'll come back here. <laughs> Should be able to take care of the Seekers a lot easier with, you know, a mounted machine gun, hopefully. Alright, so this building is clear. We're going to boogie out of here. I was going to try to get to that cop car right there, but you know what, I'm going to uh, lag in pretty bad because I know that there's a lot of stuff in this old west town. <coughs> Lagging should stop once I'm out of the town. Because we are going to head back to base now. Because unfortunately I'm like out of room, if you'll excuse me a moment. Sorry about that, folks. I had to take a phone call with my mom. In case any of you were wondering. <laughs> <coughs> Alrighty. So we're going to turn off here. Head back to base so I can unload everything. <coughs> I am really regretting um, not bringing the other vehicle with the six lockers in it because obviously I could have carried a lot more loot. But at the same time, I wanted to get more water to distill. Um, I can distill almost 50 liters at a time, five zero. So that's quite a bit. I am just so psyched about having that garage. Because it took so much, like, like 
<coughs> if you guys are having trouble locating the materials to build this garage, it's pretty simple. If you go on your map, you can go down to the construction site. It is a work in progress area, but the, the construction site is there. You can get bags of concrete and cinder blocks there, but I strongly suggest having a vehicle <coughs> with um, lockers in it because you're definitely going to need it. Sorry about that. All right, so let's get unloaded here. Unfor oh, wow. Unfortunately, I was only able to find one uh, high-quality metal scrap, so that is really going to slow me down. All right, let's find another feather. That goes in there. I don't think anything else goes in here. Oh, wow. I don't even have room. How about that? Oh, jeez. Okay, I'm going to throw some of these rags away. I have hammers coming out of my freaking ears, so I'm going to throw those away. Um, I do not know how to use the scissors to upgrade stuff. Uh, it was never really explained to me. These only have 0 0.2 in them, so I'm not going to bother saving those. Shovels I have an abundance of and never use. Let's see, I have plenty of those. And plenty of sewing kits. Alright, everything else I'm going to keep. Is there anything that goes in there? Yes, the booze, okay. I'm actually going to whip up some Molotovs real quick, so... I have plenty of jeans, too, so I can throw those away. i probably regret that, but... Because I'll probably end up needing them in the long run. And fill up the empty whiteies, as I call them. All right, uh, fill up this one too. Okay. Now I finally reached my goal and I have 10 of them extra, well 11 with the one I have obviously. All right, let's see. You know what, I'm gonna put those canned goods in the fridge since I have room for them in my last fridge. You cannot shift click these into the refrigerator. I have no idea why. Get on that, developers. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding around. I love this game. Thank you so much to the developers for creating this awesome freaking title. Because I'm like straight up addicted to it. <laughs> Got that fridge full, got that fridge full. Jerky, jerky, jerky. Wow, I actually have an empty fridge, that's rare. But um, these should be done, yes, I can pick these up. We're just about to hit the one minute mark, so I'm just going to pop these off the drying rack and into my refrigerator. I don't think... Nope, can't shift click those out of there either. Alright, I'm going to go put these away. Those, that's for raw. Put the raw jerky in that refrigerator. But we're down under a minute. Thank you all so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Um, thank you again so much for all your support. Uh, for the channel, for me, for everything. Have a great evening, and I'll see you on the flip side.